So this morning I had a problem with my um, my kicker snap losing uh, power again and basically the reason is there's a little white sticker on the inside here and over here I've already loosened the screws so there's three screws that keeps this whole <coughs> thing together there's a little sensor there that guy basically tracks the speed of the the, the speed and the passing rate of the tick uh, of the little sticker now I'm um, this morning out of urgency I moved it quickly so let's just see if I can see where it's supposed to uh, there it, it, it's supposed to well it, whoops where's my finger it used to be there so I'm just going to clean that off with a bit of alcohol and then I'm going to stick the whole thing back on with some proper glue there we go so um, I just rubbed it down a bit and while everything is evaporating and cleaning up um, there is a, a bit of a, a mark there still but the glue I'm planning on use uh, which is glue devil um, this is pretty strong stuff so hopefully this will be a thing of the past what happens is this thing heats up because of the electromagnet sitting on the inside and then this becomes so hot that you can see actually these little bubbles under these chevrons it, it, it becomes so hot that anything that's stuck to it kind of comes loose um, and this is not the first time this has happened so I've seen all kinds of little mods and things that guys have done I've contacted Wahoo you don't void your warranty by doing this um, although it's not something you should be doing often um, but then also um, this isn't something that should be happening uh, they did offer to send me some new stickers so I'll, I'll take them up on that offer but um, I can't risk losing my workout information in the way that uh, that I've been affected in the past uh, so let me just glue this sucker up basically a reflective little sticker so if you look at it it's it's hard so it's not it's not plastic but it's like a reflective um, if if I was to bend it now I'd probably snap it it's like plastic almost so I wouldn't say it's brittle but um, obviously because the little sensor in there needs need some kind of infrared to bounce off it this is basically what it is and I found it lying on the carpet so if you don't know to look for this you'll overlook it and just think that your train is broken Okay, so apparently the position is quite important and also the, the broad side must be ab above and the, um, the smaller side at the bottom because the sensor itself also measures the time or the length of the sticker that's quite important it's not just about when it passes but how long it takes to pass as well I think it uses that to detect the speed so yeah, um, hope that helps um, it's not a train smash when this happens it's just horribly inconvenient so hopefully this will stop now um, I've tried putting a fan on my flywheel didn't work doesn't cool it down and it's normal for your flywheel to heat up um, I've tried after every ride I've got a knife uh, like a little butter knife or something that I just stick in and 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 push down on the sticker and it's it's been looking fairly good but this morning we did a three hour ride and at about two hours 40 the sticker popped off um, obviously because and it was a flat route there wasn't even a lot of resistance but this happened to me before after doing a, a big climb which is just a lot of heat build up that happens on the inside there okay hope this helps uh, took me quite a while to figure out and it's not very well documented at all